everyone. Just gonna do a quick show and tell video of this mild Dragic level 3 armor plate and carrier. Honestly, I don't know much about this plate carrier at all because there's hardly any, any information. But I do know that it's a polyethylene plate. This is the back side, at least I think this is the back side. Now originally, these straps did not have these buckles on. I added them on because it was, originally you had to loop the, uh, the Velcro through this and it would just kind of hook onto itself. But that was kind of a trap. It's really difficult to get out of that, so I added, added these buckles to make it easier to get in and out of. Mild tragic. So it kind of works like this, in a way. This is the shoulder piece. And I kind of find it kind of odd that this hook is on the outside. Felt the hook. Same goes for here. Uh, not really sure what's going on. But it's East European stuff, it's always a mystery compared to, you know, Western American or whatever. So let's have a look at one of the plates. Polyethylene, kind of fabric on the outside, layers, then you have the foam padding on the back. Of course, there's nothing over here, nothing written. Let's try to get the other side because there are, these are two different plates for some reason. I'm not exactly sure why, but. Oh, let's see, how do you do this? Alright, so this is the odd part. So, one side, you know, you have the, you know, just insert it through the top. But what I'm assuming is the back side, you insert it through the side. You can see the Velcro right there. So let's try to pop that off. up like that. Alright, so that's the front plate, and that's the back plate. Uh, I'm not sh exactly sure why I have two different plates. One is made in 2002, it's right there, and the other is made in 1999. Of course, I would want the most recent one in the front. Same deal, polyethylene with the uh, foam on the back. Let's try to get this standing up, but here, you can see the foaming on the uh, 2002 plate, a bit more thicker. But these are both level 3 plates, they should be able to stop up to um, pretty much any ball round, most ball rounds but not like M855 or any armor piercing kind of stuff. So 762 by 39 ball, M193. I'm not sure about M80 ball. I also forgot to mention that these plates are a little bit curved, but overall they're pretty much rectangular. They're not like sappy plates, but they are, I guess in a way, single curve.
Now, shielding your rifle is actually kind of interesting. So you just kind of rest the uh, stock on top of the plate and just rolls right into your shoulder. But there is a bit of limitations you can see.